Okay, let's talk about our today's special, and it's not one, it's actually a two-pack. I'm super, super pumped about this because they are a blast. Look at this, the hand-controlled aircraft drones. Now, last year and the years prior to this, what we've offered is a single. So we truly doubled it up but didn't double the price. What you're paying for one, we've actually added a bonus one to it and it's only while they last. And unfortunately, we're down to the final quantity. This is it. And of course, it's the very end of the day. So I got two colors remaining and it doesn't matter for me. Either one I think works for anybody. You either get the two-pack of the chrome rose gold color or the two-pack of the chrome red color. They both come with remotes, but it couldn't be easier and it couldn't be more fun than when you're playing with these. Now, this is our last and final full presentation of it. And again, I had a bunch more colors when the day started, but this is what I got now. So definitely you wanna hurry to get what I have now remaining because they're both only a couple thousand left. Day special price, five flex. We even have free shipping. Couldn't get better than that. All right, let me get Justin out. Of course, I'll introduce him. Hi, Just. How are you? Oh, I am good. Which ones I'm are ready. We playing with? I want to get up. I don't like standing here. Yeah, well, let, here. yeah. I mean, what's the point of oh, sitting when we can be flying? Let's fly. So really fun. I know this is the last presentation, and even although we might have limited in colors, there is not going to be a difference what color it is when you get to have it on and you start to play with it. So okay, much so fun. one little button that turns it on, and then you're going to notice that little green light that looks like a alien in the cockpit you put it in the palm of your hands and you're not grabbing a remote because your hand is the remote we're going to show you that in just a second so i'm going to go ahead and throw it up in the air and now it's going to fly itself and now if you start to think about all the tech on, that is in this, this yeah way. let's go over to it because so, this has sensors room. on the bottom infrared sensors on the bottom it's got infrared sensors on the side so it'll actually know where my hand is underneath it it'll know when my hand is on the side of it so now i can start to pass it to you Suze. and now we are literally throwing and passing a UFO in the house. Whoop. And, <laughs> just, and, then, and then, yeah, exactly. Well, first and of all. And we don't really care that it fell. Ex exactly. <laughs> That's the thing about it. It's super durable. And then even if you wanted to just go ahead and grab it and catch it, you can. You can't do that with other drones. And the really cool thing is that we're also including that little remote, which all you can do with that now is be able to take it. And now, instead of throwing it up in the air, it's go ahead and click that button. And it's going to take off on its own. And if it's too high, then you're saying, well, how do I get it down? Down, use that same little clicker and now they're gonna start to land themselves and now you are full-on control you know mind games Jedi <laughs> of all your little UFOs so then you press that button and then two of them fly I'll turn this one on oh that one just hit the other one <laughs> they just took each other out okay these are so much fun you guys they are a blast and it's fun for everybody it's not just oh it's fun for just you know the kids in my life everyone's gonna want to play with these because they're such a blast hey guys I'd love it if we can bring that whole thing over here behind me if you guys don't mind bringing it over because I'm not there's just not enough room to run over there I gotta be where we got some space it's so, where's, you're the unicorn you need space to I run go, and be know. free I gotta be free I gotta get some room to run around I don't wanna be squished over there on the couch because this is how it's gonna be like when you're at home oh yeah you know what I mean clear it's the like, room move the couch back come on everybody exactly. let's have a ball with these now something else to remember you're getting two complete sets so it's two of everything right Dustin? Mm -hmm. so all the you get two recharge chargers you get two of the little remote control but it's just this easy as you pop it up and you have fun. Yeah, you know, you're not going to think about what age somebody is because you're not going to think, well, are they old enough to be able to figure it out? Are they right. young enough to be able to figure it out? All you do is use your hand to control the direction of it and <laughs> it's got the gyroscope to where it literally will basically float in that one little spot until it senses, cool? for instance, a wall, a tree, a hand, like we're showing you right there, <laughs> and then you use the force to pass it back and forth like we used to do with the balloons and yeah. then all you need to do is throw it up in the air again and now it's off and flying but what we discovered is if you kind of play this little game with it if you trap Wait, it let me get out of the way you gotta show if this you trap so cool. it and it stops spinning and then it will do a flip Look, it did the flip and now not only is it cool it's flipping awesome I okay <laughs> and what we i don't know if i told you this what we've been saying they're they're ufomgs Yo, yeah. oh there you there go there you go i had to get that Justin's out that been one here more all day long folks. can you tell join him next week at the holiday Inn. he'll be performing <laughs> no exactly. but this is so cool because again you don't have to physically touch it now if i do want to touch it here's what i really like as a mom yeah, you know exactly what I mean? none of the fan is on the outside so if you look at it really really close see how this is all completely covered and it's also smushy so it's really nice it's smushy 
Yeah, if it happens to hit a head or hit something or hit the pet or whatever, you don't have to worry about it. And I like the fact that the little blades, which are soft anyway, yeah. are built inside. Exactly. So, you, you know, it's designed to use your hand. So, of course, you want it to be protected in case there was a little finger there. And so the other part is, I'm going to even turn this off. I'll throw this up in the air with it off, and you'll see it bouncing off of the ground. These have fallen from about 15 feet up in the studio. They bounce. So even when they land that way, there's not going to be any damage. I can't tell you how many times for a Christmas we got those little drones. They flew for about 20 seconds before somebody hit a wall, and a propeller flew that way, and then you couldn't find the other one. Yeah. And then this one, this is actually designed to fly in the home. This just threw up in the air. And now you get to fly it, and you don't need a fight over it. And the other thing about it is, I gotta tell you, I don't know how many steps I've gotten in, but this is all pretty much exercising, chasing a true. UFO around. That is, well, you know what's kind of fun too, is how often do you look at your kids, your grandkids, and they got their nose in their phone, or they're on a tablet or a gaming system. What this does, it gets everybody up. It gets everybody up and it gets them moving and they're having a ball. It is, you can't, we were laughing about this last hour, you can't help but smile when you're playing with these darn things. Yeah. And there's something about the Jedi magic of just putting your hand out and moving it around without touching it that is so cool. It, it is, right? <laughs> I mean, it's something very, you know, it's a bit arbitrary when you have the remote control, right? But to be able to use your body to dictate, you know, yeah. which direction that it goes. Right. And now you get to, like, literally feel like you're playing catch in, like, you know, the, in the future, right? Yes, yes. It's like t the Space Odyssey version of playing catch <laughs> with a UFO. Yeah, it's, I'm telling you, it's going to be one of the most fun gifts you'll give anybody this holiday season. And we have, and just, we knew this from last hour too. There's many of you who are getting more than one set because number one, it's a really awesome gift. And number two, if you're doing the church, you know, uh, they're collecting toys, it's perfect for that. If you said, gosh, I got a lot of people to buy for and they're really tough to purchase something, it doesn't matter. Anyone yeah. is gonna absolutely love this thing. And I really love the video too, cause like kids who normally wouldn't wanna play together yeah. actually will wanna play together, <laughs> which is pretty unusual to see in many households. But look at that dog, I love the dog going crazy. Oh, that's yeah. the cutest. Uh, and I think really when you even watch that video, you're like that's exactly what it would be like in the house, right? Where you find the hallway, you find the room, and all of a sudden the kids are playing in the bedroom. They've got their own UFOs. Mom, mine's the, mine's the red one, mine's the, mine's the rose gold, whatever it is. And then to know that you're not gonna have to worry about batteries. These are completely rechargeable. 20 to 5 to 30 minutes to recharge. You get 8 minutes of fly time. If you're getting two of them, of course, you're getting 16 minutes of fly time. Throw it up in the air. They're flying, and they're flying nonstop. So really, you don't even need to baby them. So right now, they can even sense each other. If you notice they kind of go up and down, it's because they're going to then sense with that infrared sensor underneath them where the ground is. So as it's flying around or even getting close to a wall, it'll move away from that wall just like it did with my hand. And then what we discovered is if you catch it in that one spot, let me see if I can do it, and then you go underneath it, Okay, it does I, a that's flip. the best. I gotta try it and see if I can it do it. It does a flip. I was, I did yeah, it you once. Do, you did it, you did it on it. Oh, you, you had it, you had it. Oh. I did it! Oh my God, oh, you guys missed it. Hey, it's a little unicorn. Hard. Thank you, I did it. Unicorn. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to watch that unicorn work, that little robotic unicorn. <laughs> but again, we're talking about hours of real fun and people are getting off their computers, they're getting off their phones, they're getting off their tablets and actually interacting with each other and moving. You know, so many kids nowadays, they say one of the really bad things about all this social media and all this oh, computer stuff oh, is yeah. kids just aren't moving anymore. Well, don't even get me started on that. I mean, you're stuck on your phone, you get the neck phone, you know, the, the phone neck, and then yeah. social media, I mean, I think the idea here is is that if even if it's a 10 minute break away yeah. from all of that, yeah. social media, phone, whatever it might be, and then of course, even for us adults, I think we could use a 10, you know, eight to 10 minute break of just something that's mindless <laughs> So that you're true. just sitting there and you're up and you're moving and you're just smiling and you're having fun and you're like, who would have thought I'd be sitting here playing with a UFO little drone that I don't even have to worry about a remote control and then, you know what, if I got people over, we can, a little, we can literally pass it around the house. Okay, so let me give you a quick update of where we stand. Um, okay, I don't know why, um, Brandon, but you're completely cracking up, <laughs> just so you'll know. I can hear Justin fine, but I think I got an update. Okay, if you want the red, there are less than 2,000 now left. That's the chrome red. The other option that we have is the chrome rose color. So there's your red, there's your rose. Remember, you're getting the remotes. These are totally rechargeable, so that's great. You just charge them up again, and they charge really fast, so not a big deal there. Um, if you're thinking about picking it up, though, unfortunately, the, just the last two options are obviously pretty limited.
So it's a great time to finally get these ordered while I still have a few left. I believe what's gonna happen is the red's gonna sell out in this area. So if you are thinking about grabbing that red set, and again, I just had a great um, idea last hour, is get both colors and then mix them up. So if you wanna give you know, red to whoever and the rose to somebody else, that's fine. You can give two gifts, however you wanna do it. Really nice time to pick it up. And as we mentioned earlier, Justin, yeah. one of these were last year, was great, it was fine, it was hugely successful. We don't do them very often, mm -hmm. so they're always a big deal, right? We doubled it up and didn't double the price. And it's a true buy one, and we've thrown an additional one in as a bonus. So now is the best time to ever pick these up. And I like it because it's fun, and it's yeah. safe, and it's easy, and you just smile when you're playing with it. I'm telling you, my my face literally hurts me because all day, Not I mean, not only have I just been standing around and jumping around, and chasing these UFOs, but you've just been smiling because it's just that genuine feeling of like being a kid. You know, there's not a lot of different things that you can get an adult where they're gonna be moving around and then play with the kids. And then the younger kids and the older kids are playing together. Mm -hmm. The siblings are finally not fighting. And then they're just kind of having that just mindless fun of passing something around like a UFO in the house. And one of the things that, you know, I think we could even add to the value, which is you only would get the UFO when we had it by itself. Right. Not only are you getting the UFO, you're getting it with the remote control, which we didn't do before. So the remote control is an even extra added value. That's how if we wanted to, if this was flying too high, we just simply press that button and then it lands itself. Or three, two, one, lift off. <laughs> Ground control to Major Tom. <laughs> We've got a UFO. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. Thank you. Also, thank you. We'll I do you, a lot of the microphones. The lights yeah. are really bright. <laughs> like, it's really fun when the lights are down a little bit <clears throat> or the lights are off. That adds more to the fun of it because, the, the really, it's surprisingly bright how yeah. cool the lights are. So, as you see, you know, when it's not flying, it's green. When you start to fly it, it's got that disco light. So it's really, you know, I think you're right. A lot of these kids and big kids alike are going to want to be flying it with the lights down or going outside totally and flying would. it. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah. But I think, too, is, you know, it's winter time. You're not going to be flying drones outside for probably a few months. I know certainly not in, in Philly, let alone in Minneapolis and <laughs> Buffalo. <laughs> Um, actually, you know what? If we could get un the underneath shot of it, let me see if we can lift that up. He looks, it is really cool. Look how cool it is uh, when you look underneath it. It looks it? even better. Let me go, let me, let's see. I don't think we can get it. Shoot. Because it's really awesome. It reflects off the chrome, actually. Yeah, the chrome. I didn't That's even think about it. That's a little different. The chrome because does... the other ones weren't shiny. Right, we're not. Oh, that's a great shot. Now we're seeing it Perfect. right there. Perfect. Oh, that's so awesome. That's perfect. We have an unidentified <laughs> flying object inside of the studio. We're not sure what it is. Is it? Is it a bird? Is it a plane? Is it Santa? No, that's a UFO. <laughs> that is just, it's an absolute blast, you guys. And again, take advantage of the offer while we have it. Unfortunately, this is about to wrap up. And the red, if you want the chrome red, that is, okay, I've got 1,800 remaining in the chrome red. Uh, the other color is going to be the rose gold color, which I still have a couple thousand left. We're okay there. But if you want to get that red, I would not wait at all. Those most likely will sell out in this um, last airing. And you got to remember, too, when we hit midnight, we launch a brand new today's special. This one might be around, but it'll only be in the rose gold. It's not going to be available in the red color at all. Let's talk about some of the technology. Yes. There's so many advanced things in here. I was just thinking the same thing. surprising for the price. I was just thinking the same thing. So, you know, when you really think about it, you break it down. When we think about the advancement of tech, maybe we're not thinking drones, but I want you to think about what's in this, right? There's a gyroscope that's built in it. There's four propellers. There's a microchip that's built in it. That's how it can actually know the little signals that you give it with the infrared. Speaking of infrared, there's three different infrared sensors, which is how it knows spatially to avoid any type of different obje objects, inanimate or animate being your hand. That's how it's a hand-controlled UFO. It's got the LED lights. It's got rechargeable batteries. And yeah, it's only like 14 bucks. I mean, you don't think about that with something that's like this type of tech right. that can fly for eight minutes that you can catch and not like any other drone where you're not gonna try and catch a drone that's flying up, right? You're probably gonna want that drone to just continue to fly because the propellers are exposed. With these, they're not exposed. Even if they were, even if it was to just crash, right? If it was to just fall on the floor, it bounces. These have done it all day long, okay? All day long they've done that. Turn it back on, put it back, back in the palm of your hands, throw it back up in the air, and then we're flying. And then when you want to catch it, 
You just literally snag it with your hand, flip it upside down, and then it turns off. But don't forget, with that remote, if it lands somewhere and you want it to take back off again, just use that remote control to go ahead and have liftoff, which of course every kid is gonna be, you know, basically narrating the whole entire thing. We have been, we have landed on Mars and we, we have found the exoplanet. We're gonna <laughs> land now back onto the moon and three, two, and one, we have landed. Now we can't return back to Earth before we, you know, disinfect the spaceship. I don't know, God. you just get creative. Can you tell I was a single child, Suzanne? Yes, yeah, well you have a grand imagination. That's what I love. You do, that's so cute. By the way, I pulled this one out just to show you as a demo of it flying. We don't have this color available anymore, just so if you see us messing around with yeah. it, um, just FYI. But you know what's really kind of cool too is the magic of just lifting it up. Yeah. Like when you throw it up and it, it floats. And, and so the reason why it's actually, you know, it can do that is because of the gyroscope. And the reason why it's spinning in 360 is because it's using the infrared sensors on both sides of it, right? Obviously it's a circle, so essentially on two sides of it to know where your hand is. And then that little sensor on the bottom is what gives it that lift. So then the engine that propels those propellers actually kicks it a little higher to give it that lift. And don't forget, there's that game that's built into it, right? Yeah. So if I go ahead and I try and do what I call, I kind of call it like trapping the UFO. If I put my hand on both sides of it, it's gonna stop spinning if I can do it correctly. The challenging part is, is trying to get it right. Of course it's not gonna do it now. But if you do it correctly, then you can get the UFO to flip. And so, of course, I kind of like that it's challenging because the closer you try and get to it, the more it's going to try and get away from you. And then all of a sudden you're running around and you're chasing it and then you're getting exercise. And then you're saying, I hope I've got my Apple Watch on. I've got my <laughs> Fitbit on. How many steps am I'm I at? How many steps done. <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> it is. It's just really, really a blast. And it's something that they'll literally have so much fun playing with it. And here's the other thing I love about it. It's for any age, honestly. I mean, and obviously not teeny little kids, but I mean like adults. Like, do you have that really hard to buy for 20 something kid in your life, like a guy, right? Or maybe it's my husband is, you know, he's just hard to buy for. He would have a ball with this. So I don't look at this as just being kind of a kid's toy. I think anybody, do you have that geek in your life, which I have lots of geeks in my life, but they'll love this stuff. Cause it's, out, it's, it's unusual, it's fun. If they love, like you said, the Star Wars and the Jedi oh, thing, yeah. or the Star Trek kind of thing. The, the fact that you can actually move it with your hand without touching it there's just something so unbelievably cool about that feature <laughs> and, and there's a reason why i think stocking stuffers exist because look i don't want just one big present i guess you know that i sound spoiled when i say that i don't want just one big present i want all the cool little fun little ones that come you know before it where i get to kind of open them up and i get to have fun and maybe the, you know this is what i end up spending all the time with and we've been talking about it all day, that this is basically one of those Christmas gifts, whether it's a stocking stuffer or not, that you end up playing with more than whatever the big gift possibly was even for Christmas. And you're sitting there even as a parent or a grandparent saying, I thought that they would have loved that. They ended up loving the UFO. I should have just gotten more of the UFOs. Do that, get more while you can, because I know we're gonna be selling out of them soon. Yes, unfortunately, like what are we at? 51,000 sets have been ordered today. It's very funny, because I have friends always say, is that all month? And I'm like, what are you talking about? I'm like, no, 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 that's today. Yeah, that's from So 51,000 sets have been ordered today. We're down to the last couple thousand, I mean, that's it. If you want the chrome red, and we have discovered that when you get the chrome, the lights play and have a lot more fun. They're a lot brighter, because they reflect off the chrome finish. So if you you want the chrome red or you're going to get the chrome rose gold those definitely have a really cool effect that the other guys earlier today just didn't have because they didn't have the mirror finish you know honestly i mean of course it would take us to the last Plus presentation last to show. realize that yeah. but the chrome does give the lights that you, i flipped you it did oh, a, you did the flipping it. it does give that really cool little reflective kind of disco ball that type the other colors glow. didn't earlier yeah, that it wouldn't do right because yeah. those were more of a matte finish with that print so with the chrome it does get, reflect the light and it gives it that shine like a brand new 
you know, I was going to say Corvette, but that's a UFO. I mean, it's the, it's the Corvette of space. That's right. Um, but it's just so much fun. I know we keep saying that, but I got to tell you, I've been doing it all day. It hasn't gotten old. Um, and it's just a lot of stuff that you can do with it. The fact that you can catch it. I love being able to kind of have that hand-eye coordination. Yeah. You know, there's not a lot of things that you can do inside of the house that will build hand-eye coordination. Right. This could be one of those things. And then you're just running around chasing it. Then you can start to talk about all the science aspect of it. If you're a teacher, if you know somebody's a scientist, science teacher or somebody who's just a techie or a trekkie whatever it might be <laughs> right. they're gonna love this kind of stuff because anything that flies and I can control it with my hands and oh by the way it's got cool lights on it yeah I want that I, well, and plus you don't have to have a remote to fool with you don't have to worry about losing the remote you know all of this is really easy but it is the magic of that darn thing moving by the just the movement of your hands not even touching it that makes you smile it's just it's weirdly magical oh. <laughs> like you know you always think oh I'd love to be able to move stuff like yeah. you see in the movies, right? Right, of course. Now you literally can without touching it. It's so cool. Also, you did this there you earlier. Go. Yeah, the, you, Get you, your feet involved. You got the hacky sack. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> I, I could never hacky sack. I, I, my hands, I'm great. Feet? The feet, you couldn't get it. Could not play. I could. I was the worst soccer player. I was the goalie. <laughs> I was the goalie. If I had to kick anything, I would just catch it. I'd roll it. But this just teaches that kind of hand-eye coordination. You know, maybe, you know, it doesn't matter what kind of gender it is because now you don't even have to really even catch it. But having all of, you know, we had Peyton in here earlier. I think she was about eight or nine. Uh -huh. And she and I have done a lot of these presentations before. But I love it. She's just so confident. She just goes ahead and she grabs it and she looks at me. She smiles and it's just like... You got it. It's so easy to do. Right, yeah, there's not a huge learning curve on this. So, you know, it's really, you throw it up in the air, it catches itself, and then, I mean, you know, it can land itself, it can start itself, but you just toss it in the air and let the party begin. And, you know, we said this a little earlier, too. Think about beyond just the holiday gifts. Think about all the birthdays coming up. Um, if you've got a little closet or a shelf that you'd like to put extra toys and extra gifts in there. Maybe you've got the grandkids coming to visit after the holidays. Yeah. You want to give them something really fun they'll play with have it ready to go, but you don't want to miss out on the offer. And we said this last hour too, I love all the toys we do, especially when we do these really cool remote control things or these like, game called remote control, but the cool thing that we're doing. Unfortunately, we only do it maybe twice a year, sometimes Christmas in July, and then only in the fourth quarter. And by the way, all of these we have in stock, we've put on the air today. So it's not like, oh, we've got another 20,000 coming in three weeks from now. No, what we have in stock is literally what we have available right now. Unfortunately, in the red, we're down to the last 900 sets. So let me show you it one more time. And when it blinks red, it means it needs to be plugged in and recharged, but no batteries need needed for these. Thank you very much. Yeah, exactly. Yep. Because that can be expensive. Last look at the red. Isn't that pretty? I love the red. I think it's really cool. I've got about 800 left in the red. Now, what's going to be remaining after this sells out will be the rose gold color. But we both have discovered that getting the metallics is actually almost cooler than the solids we had earlier because they're so much more reflective. You can really see the lights play on these. Yeah, it's like, it basically looks like chrome, you know? And so the way yeah. that that light will shine off the chrome and then the fact, the fact that it's all of those cool little disco lights, the red, the green, the blue that's constantly flashing. When you have it on, it's gonna be that green. And I kinda like that it's the green color because it just makes me feel like there's an alien flying the spaceship, <laughs> exactly what that looks like. And then when I start to fly this one, you'll notice that it's gonna start to have all of those cool uh, flashing colors. So yeah, that's like what's really nice blue, about it reflecting. Red, exactly, that's yeah. what's nice about it reflecting off of that chrome because when the lights are actually down, then you've got that really cool reflective light coming and bouncing off all of the different angles of the UFO. So whether it's daytime, whether it's nighttime, whether you decide to just close all of the blinds, okay? And just have fun. And just have fun. This is one of those things that is just nothing but fun. And I guess the, the only thing I can say is, Yes, if your face is going to feel sore the next day, it's because you've been smiling nonstop like I am. Because it is truly one of the coolest gifts you'll give anybody. I don't care what age they are, they're going to love it, I swear. All right, Justin, I think I get to let you go go. Is, that, is, this, is, is this time? Are I we think sure? This is it. I'm going to let okay. you go for now. Okay, I'm going to beam me up. <laughs> beam oh, there me you go. I'll straight throw to you bed. up here. I'll just okay, pick you up. Okay, there you go. You. Okay, I'm out of here. <laughs> if we could just do that. <laughs> Bye, Justin. Thank Bye. you for a great day. Hey, by the way, we've got a whole lot going on on HSN. Com, including one of my favorite areas in the whole wide world, which is